Murray again. He'll loft it. Wide open receiver. And it's Calcaterra. Touchdown OU. 35 yards. Grant Calcaterra. Had three catches at TCU last week. He's a Mackey Award candidate. When you've got time in the pocket, what happens is that you can clear out the zone, that left side. Watch these two post routes. They clear out the safety. Then Calcaterra finds the opening, that soft spot, and Kyler Murray has all day to throw, drops it over the top. Second down and 11. Murray, he's got a receiver, C.D. Lamb. And there he goes. C.D. Lamb. Touchdown, OU, 82 yards. First down and 10 at the 15. Murray, another short pass. This time, it's Miles Tees. I mean, everybody is touching the rock right now for the Sooners. They have Brooks in the backfield. They have a quarterback that can run it. Option, pitch, Brooks, six. OU, four possessions, four scores. I have no idea what you would do if you're in that position. Daquan Patton is in no man's land because he's not going to catch Brooks on the outside. Second down and goal of the nine. Murray runs it. Touchdown, Oklahoma. You got the linebacker, you got the safety. They're both in man coverage. They're going to go to their right when Sermon and Lee Morris go to their left. Right, right, and then all of a sudden, boom. I'm quick as a hiccup, and I'm to the edge, and I'm in the end zone. That's how fast it happens. Love coming here. Seven-time national champions. This time, Kansas State will get a chance. Zuber lost it. Loose ball. OU has it at the 21. Jordan Parker with the fumble recovery. Watch as Zuber's going, and then there's, yeah, there's 56, Wyatt Hubert, and he just runs into a back, and that ball pops straight up. Lack of ball security. OU on the money. Let's see if they go down and get a quick score. It might be over for the starters. Here's Brooks, first down, hits the sideline. Kennedy Brooks, the red shirt freshman from Manfield, Texas, cuts it inside. Touchdown, Sooners. 86 yards. First you get the fold block, so the offensive guard here, Ben Powers, is going to get up the middle. And then now it's Brooks, and watch as he's going to just creep out to the right side. And then the angle that he takes right there, it just beats Walker. He gets to the sidelines, and now he's gone. This guy has home run ability, and then the cutback, and he gets himself into the end zone. He's passed for close to 300 yards, 294. Murray delivers 300 plus CD Lamb touchdown Sooners that might be his final play of the game probably should be and he got away with one TV and McGee number 14 he has a chance here but he gets caught in between the ball is floated, and so he goes for it. But if you go for it, you got to at least keep that back arm on the wide receiver because there's no help down the field. All right, Kyler, 702 total yards of offense. That's a record for you guys this year. And for you, 20 touchdowns in your last four games, you told me that you are playing with a certain confidence. But specifically today, what was working so well for you guys? I think we had a great game plan going into this game, uh, and, and we really emphasized you know, being physical. We knew this was going to be a physical game. Uh, they're a very physical team, very well-coached team. And I think we came out here and did what we wanted to do as far as you know, uh, the ones coming in here and getting the job done, starting it off fast, and then you know, as you saw the second half, we rushed it pretty well with the B, uh, the B group, so it was pretty good. C.D. Lamb, two touchdowns today. He's got a touchdown in his last six. You've been finding your receivers all season long, but C.D. specifically, how do you highlight the way it is to find him and play with him? <laughs> dude, dude catches everything. I mean, I, I, you saw, you know, he, he showcases his abilities every weekend. Um, you know, he's great for us. He's great for me. And I, I just love having him on, team, on, my, on my team for sure. So, <laughs> You guys have zero fun out here. I mean, you see it, the smile on your face. You see it on the sideline. What is going to make this team go all the way? And the goal is a playoff with this group. 
I think keeping the main thing the main thing, um, one day at a time, one week at a time, and just trying to go one and zero every weekend, um, and knowing that you know that the rest of the season's not easy. You know, winning in the Big Twelve is not easy. Um, winning in no game is easy. I mean, no no conference is easy. So you know, you can't take it for granted. We just gotta keep practicing hard and you know just keep preparing. All right, Kyler, thanks. Thank you.